we're just saying, hey guys, it's close. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. To another episode. We got Zaphod B42 driving his email one. And he's not in a clan, so I can't do a shout out. So, shout out to you, buddy! Zaphod B42 has been a subscriber for who knows how long. Well, I know. For a hell of a long time. We're going to watch this game. He has a freaking great game in his Emil one. Ah, that's... Uh, how, how are things going with you guys? I just got off the phone with my mom. Called my mom just to see uh, you know, uh, how things are going. Checking out with the, uh, with the parentals, you know. They're getting ready to move. Uh, downsizing into a condo. You know, they're getting on in age and... Uh, a little less mobile. Well, my mom for sure, not my dad. He's still running around like a lunatic. Uh, but uh, yeah, the latest was, she's telling me that uh, uh, she went to get the mail. You know, they get they don't get mail delivered right to their house. It's, it, it's in those boxes down the street, so 200 yards down the street. So she went to get the mail and walked down there and picked up the few junk mail things that she had in the mailbox. And... Uh, uh, well, she's getting old, and she's uh, really her legs are uh, uh, starting to like. She just has trouble with her balance, and she's worried about falling because she's old, and she's already like uh, broken her knee once, and she's really tentative, and uh, she didn't feel comfortable walking all the way back. You know, those 200 yards were going to be difficult. So, and she's not high tech. Uh, she doesn't have a cell phone. She has an iPad because I bought her an iPad so we could FaceTime, but she doesn't have a cell phone, so. Uh, she just decided, well, I'll just wait here at the, the mailbox, and uh, eventually you know, my dad will notice she's missing or hasn't come back and do something about it. <laughs> I'm sorry to laugh, but this, <laughs> you know, you got to laugh at shit because uh, this is what happens, right? Uh, so she waits there, and I guess after about a half an hour, 45 minutes, my dad drills, where the fuck is, where is she? Where's the mail? So he just goes out the back onto the to like a porch and you, you could just see the mailbox from <laughs> Hey! What are you doing? You've been gone 45 minutes! The coffee's getting cold! What? I can bring the mail! <laughs> He's worried there might be some bills in there or something we have to pay. What the hell's taking you so long? So, I mean long story short, he had to go get her and with the car and bring her back at 300 yards and you know. Uh, so it's come time that she, she had a cane and she forgot to bring it because she doesn't like people seeing her with her cane, right? And, uh, but she forgot to bring it. And she, long story short, uh, my dad decided it's time, it's time to get a walker. You know, there's enough of this. We're, we're going walking and you're going to keep up. I'll get you a walker. So he, uh, he got her a walker. My mom's telling me she doesn't like the walker. It's, uh, she, not used to it and it makes on the sidewalk every time she goes over one of the little you know the the, the seams it makes noises and she doesn't like it <laughs> I was after I talked to my mom I talked to my sister I said oh your mom's got a walker and how's it going she goes can you believe it the dad got mom a walker but he didn't bring her to get the walker, you know, to pick out the one, go to a place and, and pick out one that she's come. No, 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 he just went to Shoppers Drug Mart and you know, went up to the clerk and said, I need a walker, just, a, you know, an average uh, walker, not so expensive, just, uh, she's okay, she walks okay, but she needs a little help, and uh, you know, just uh, one of your uh, regular walkers for the regular peoples. And so he just got her one, and, uh, <laughs> and I said, why did he bring her so she could look at them? And, uh, and pick out one for herself so she could decide what walker she, she my sister says yeah that's what i asked him and he says what do you mean bring her she can't even walk how am i gonna bring her <laughs> so he got her a walker and she doesn't like it and now they go walk in and she still can't keep up with the walker and my sister tells me now that uh, uh <laughs> when they're out walking and my mom's with the walker and he's in front he gets impatient and grabs the walker and starts pulling her along so there's an old, you know, agile old man in front of an older uh, woman in a walker, pulling the walker, and she's stumbling forward trying to keep up. Every now and then she cranks on the handbrake to slow it down so she can 
takes shuffle a few steps to keep up. And this is what they're doing. Thank God they're moving to a condo where there's less stairs. I'm going to have to go back there and help them with the move. Take my truck and move all the little stuff for them. And they're so worried about what the things they need to... Uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff in the garage. What am I going to do with it? I have my three jars of nails. I have two jars of screws. I have all sorts of washers, these tools. But the, my old head shears. Do I need to bring them? Can we sell them? What is it, this Kijiji thing? And, um... Uh, yeah, so I called my dad and uh, wanted to just have a chat with him. Say, you know, give mom a break. She's, uh, uh... Don't pull her along so fast on the walker, right? He's still really agile. He goes out... Like, he's out... He's retired and he's out fishing three, four times a week. He's living the dream. You know, out fishing with the boys. Uh, which is great, you know, he's enjoying it. And my mom is like, he's always out fishing, you know. He comes home, he's got the summit. We have freezer, is full of fish. I don't even like the fish. We have to eat fish three, four times a week. I don't know what to do. Tell him to stop fishing. Uh, <laughs> I kid you not, I'm not making this up. I hope they're not listening. If you're listening, guys, I love you. I'm just telling stories, you know. It's what I do for a living. Speaking of which, I'm talking to my dad and he's... Because I got my mom an iPad. So that we could FaceTime and keep in touch, you know. Because it's long distance and it's too expensive. Uh, so I got her the, uh, the, the, the iPad and my dad says, I saw on the iPad one of your videos. Are you still in, on the YouTubes? What the hell are you doing on the YouTubes? How do you... What are you doing on the YouTubes? How do you make a living on the YouTubes, you bum? Get a job. And I started explaining to him how the world's changed. And, you know, in the old days, uh, when he was... In their days, you, you just go get cable and you pay your 50 or 60 bucks a month. And you watch whatever is on your cable. And you pay the... Whatever network that has offers cable. And they make all the money and they choose what's on there and you watch. But now the world has changed. And there's creators everywhere on all sorts of different platforms and nobody controls them and nobody owns them it's just the platforms allow you to put stuff on there like uh, YouTube and a whole bunch of other places Twitch and stuff and people that appreciate independent creators can support them they can uh, just like I'm saying dad just like you would have paid for cable someone else uh, you know joins my patreon page or becomes a, a sponsor and uh, supports me and pays uh, me for making YouTube videos. He goes, what are you talking about? Who's going to give uh, money to some stupid guy on the YouTubes when you got a cable? And uh, <laughs> I just, it's just, it's too difficult to explain. But I said, well, remember when we were in Mexico and uh, uh, we were on holidays and that guy was doing the juggling act and you laughed and we watched him there for 10 minutes and then he had a hat and you, you went up there and you put 500 pesos in there? Uh, uh, you know? Do you remember doing that? He goes, yeah, 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 but he's outside doing a something. You're just on the internet. You do nothing. I give him the cash money. What the hell you got? And, uh, you know, I tried to explain it, but it doesn't really matter. Uh, it's the different, it's the old generation. You know, they worked hard all their lives and built the earth as we know it now. Everything we got and everything you enjoy and everything we do is all because of them. You think about it. Everything on Earth uh, is because of that generation. So uh, you should always treat them with respect. And anyways, that's uh, that's my story for today. Uh, that's uh, that's what I got for you. We missed the gain, Zaphod, but you're an old subscriber. It was great. You did well. But who the fuck cares? It's just a video game. Life is life. And uh, if you guys haven't called your mom and dad for a while... Uh, because, you know, you're lazy or you're just a dumb fuck. Get on the phone or uh, the, the FaceTime or whatever it is that you use and give them a call and talk to them and see how they're doing. And uh, <laughs> I got to call my dad back and just tell her not to you know, pull my mother along in behind them when she's using the walker. But she's so slow. What do you think? I'm going to go around the block. It's going to take half an hour. Oh!